Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a summer's day view towards the sky, looking through some leaves. And here is an up close shot. And I'm going to demo this middle fingernail. You can see I smudged it, but I need to demo it out for you guys anyways. So yeah, let's start. I'm going to list the colors down below. I used yellow, a yellow, blue, light blue, white, and some silver. Trixie by Zoya. A wonderful color. It's absolutely gorgeous. All right. So this is a smushing technique. We're going to be demoing. The yellow and the silver. Yeah. Some blue, maybe. Okay, I think that will be all right. I'm gonna blend everything late. Okay, when it when it dries, let me clean up. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. And going to just need you can do that whole image, but for this particular, I don't know why, I need to get a claw. <laughs> okay, I think this nail polish needs to go. I think that should be okay. Gonna turn out beautiful. There we go. So I'm gonna place another leaf, maybe like around the edges. This would also be really beautiful for the fall. Maybe like gold over brown. Or gold over black. That one didn't want to go. I've been having trouble. particular nail polish. <laughs> okay, hopefully. Okay, I think that will work. So let's do the sides here. So it looks like you're looking through, like you're laying down on some grass and looking above in the sky, at the sky. And the blue and the yellow and the silver 
represent some clouds. Very naturalistic type of clouds. It's really cool. Um, let's continue. I'm gonna... Maybe do one more right over here. From a distance, it has a very lemon lime. Kind of a thing happening, which is also really neat. too much nail polish remover. Okay, I think that will do. I only need a little bit. Just like that. Okay, for this nail, I'm going to open this up to have my little Q-tip, or not Q-tip, sorry, toothpick. I'm going to... I might have to recoat. You can do this over a bare nail. I don't like the way this nail turned out, to be very honest. So, I'm improvising. <laughs> and I think either way, however you do your accent nail is good. But I think this was a really good gonna clean up a little bit more top coat my nail here clean up a little bit I'll be right back okay I'm back I went ahead and cleaned up and this is the final look I love how the accent nail stands out it's got a nice glass foil effect it's very fresh looking and very beautiful I hope you really enjoyed this tutorial with me come join me every Friday and so beautiful. 
It really does look like you're looking through a leaf at the sky because you're on a walk in the park. And you just want to take in everything that summer has before it goes away for five whole months. Look at that, the way the light is hitting on my nail. From my accent nail, it's just, I bet in the sun, this is going to glit and sparkle. Glint and sparkle like crazy. I'm almost tempted to do every single nail like this now. So beautiful. And my middle finger, I went ahead and added another leaf right there. So there's four. And the background is ever so subtle. You can just do this so easily. You don't even need the whole image. You can scatter the leaves around. You can just use one leaf and cover your entire nail. My nails are long, so I could still cover my entire nail practically with one, with one full image of the leaf pattern. Well, thank you so much, you guys, for watching. Please stay tuned every week. Thank you, my subscribers. I love you guys so much. And, you know, I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye.